This story sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie. A company develops brain implant technology to allow people to control machines using their thoughts. No, really. In November 2022, billionaire Elon Musk said his company Neuralink was seeking permission from U.S. regulators to test its brain implant in people. A brain implant that the Government Accountability Office says will allow people to control machines using their thoughts, potentially helping people with paralysis regain control of their limbs. Now, while that could be revolutionary, Neuralink has faced criticism from animal rights groups about their testing practices and inhumane treatment of animals. In a February 2022 blog post, the company confirmed that some monkeys died during animal testing. But now the company says it's ready to test on humans. And a viral post shared on X claims Neuralink received approval from the U.S. Food and Drug Administration to begin human trials. So let's verify. Is the FDA allowing Neuralink to begin human trials? Our sources are Neuralink and the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. On May 25th, Neuralink announced they received the FDA's permission to launch its first in-human clinical study of its N1 brain implant and software. Implants like Neuralink's are considered significant risk devices, and any clinical trials that test them require approval from both the FDA and the Institutional Review Board. The FDA provided a statement to verify acknowledging Neuralink's announcement that it received FDA approval and may now begin conducting human clinical trials. So we can verify, yes, the FDA is allowing Neuralink to begin human trials. But this isn't the same thing as full FDA approval of the device. That's a more lengthy process that can only happen after the FDA reviews data from the trials to make sure the device is safe and effective. With your Verify, I'm Ariane Till.